School IP is a web-based appraisal and CPD tool for staff within schools, which links to school development plans and self-evaluation. School IP is browser-based and works on all the latest browsers, whether you are at school or at home, ensuring everything is accessible as long as you have an internet connection. All activity within School IP is strategically focused around the whole school priorities. Leaders within the school can identify staff from an appraisal perspective, seeing whether they have started their reviews, whether they've agreed their targets with their line manager, inputting their passwords, cementing objectives, observations or monitoring activities and relevant standards. You can also see if staff are engaging in a professional dialogue and the date when there was last any interaction. There's also an indication of whether the staff member has had a face-to-face -face interim review. When evidence is uploaded, there is the opportunity to link the evidence to an aspect of their appraisal. You can then filter the dialogue and the evidence to have more targeted conversation. Staff can either engage with the web-based software or they can download our mobile app. The School IP mobile app is available on both the Android and Apple platforms. Staff can view the dialogue between themselves and their line manager, adding to this dialogue by clicking on the pencil or clicking the camera to upload a photograph or video. You can upload videos to your activity feed and then you can annotate these videos to highlight areas of good practice and areas that need development. You can jump to various points within the video and if you need to add an annotation, simply click the plus icon. The video will pause allowing you to enter the text in the box below. You can identify a number of objectives for staff which can be strategic in nature and link to either whole school priorities, development plan objectives, or identified as a personal target. You can also stipulate the types of evidence that will be required to meet the objective, and where needed, divide an objective into several key activities or tasks. The recording of different types of monitoring forms is simple and effective and can be completed live on a tablet or on a laptop. You can devise as many forms as needed, tailoring the questions, judgments and guidance used on the forms. And allowing the observer to elaborate on why they have selected particular judgments. You can also record comments, areas for development and gradings if required. Gradings are not mandated. Here is an example of a form which does not contain any judgmental gradings. You can also allow staff to rate themselves against the latest standards, which again you can tailor. Line managers can also provide a judgment, and ratings are plotted on a radar diagram to help identify difference of opinion and kickstart developmental conversations. Perhaps through monitoring and other activities you can identify areas for development, and also propose action that needs to be taken. Staff can also manage their own CPD portfolio. There are three types of CPD activities. Centrally allocated activities and courses like inset and twilights. User-defined courses and activities. And the ability to request to go on a course. This is a request that needs approval in terms of spend and or cover. Staff can link the CPD request to an aspect of their appraisal and also highlight how this course will help them achieve their personal and departmental targets. These CPD requests then go through our approval workflow, which is approved by the line manager, CPD coordinator and or cover supervisor. An email is sent to the next approver in the chain. Staff can then record the impact and the quality of the provision provided. 
You can also see if the staff member has other responsibilities on the school development plan showing progress against various activities. You could also track the progress of any interim reviews or face-to-face -face meetings. At the end of the cycle, staff can close the review, finally deciding whether they have met, not met or partially met each of their targets, indicating whether the performance attained qualifies the staff member for pay progression. There is a final review outcome which may be selected, and then both the staff member and the line manager may input their passwords to cement their judgments within the system. Reviews are maintained indefinitely and they may also produce a report detailing all of their appraisal activities and evidence. School IP includes comprehensive reporting detailing many aspects of the system. It's simple to filter the data and anywhere where a table of data is produced it may be exported to Microsoft Word, Excel or PDF format. You can also anonymize the data for delivery to key stakeholders like governors. There are reports of observations, objectives, standards, areas that require development, CPD requests and the CPD activities and courses. School IP also seamlessly links to the school development plan comprised of whole school priorities, whole school and departmental objectives and further broken down into key activities and tasks. Staff can upload evidence behind activities on the plan and staff are sent email notifications to inform them of their obligations. At the click of a button you can produce professional strategic plan reports delve deeper into whole school and departmental action plan reports. Finally, we close the loop in terms of school improvement by linking to whole school and departmental self-evaluation. Each CEF is divided into a number of sections and questions. Staff can collaborate to complete their responses upload evidence or link seamlessly to evidence contained in the school development plan. Also included is the latest guidance and an audit of changes that have been completed. School IP encompasses appraisal, CPD, improvement planning and self-evaluation saving valuable time and resources and ensuring that school leaders are empowered with the information they need to improve.